What's up guys? Welcome back to the channel. Hope you guys are all having a great day today. In today's video, I'm going to show you guys how I fell for the scam. The old tomato cage scam. Uh, Daniel from Arms Family Homestead, he put a video out a couple weeks ago warning people about this scam. Um, I'll show you guys my tomatoes and the cages I'm using. Then I'm going to show you a clip of Daniel's uh, a video he put out warning um, everyone of this. You know, you guys go check the, I'll put just a short clip of him, then you guys go check out the rest of the video, and he, he'll explain to you guys what you need to do and all that stuff. Let's check out my tomato plants. You guys, there's four tomato plants in here. How many tomato cages do you see? You can probably see that one right there, okay? And there's two more I can see, and one just completely disappeared. You guys can make them out for yourselves. Okay, guys, you can see I got four tomato plants in here. And what Daniel warns us about is these little bitty tomato cages that they sell, that, that uh, the place the stores sell for tomato cages. And he said they're not tomato cages at all. He goes, they're more, they're perfect for peppers. And uh, whenever I first seen his video, and I'll show you a clip in just a second, um, I thought, oh, Daniel, they may, those, are, those are tomato cages. That's all I've ever seen people use tomato cages uh, besides what Daniel, Daniel's going to show you guys. Um, but I've, everyone buys these things. But now I know what Daniel's talking about because this year, these are the biggest tomatoes plants I've ever grown. And they have completely taken over these cages. You can see I only have many cages. They're just going everywhere. These little cages do not go well with these big tomato plants. They just don't. Uh, Daniel's absolutely right. He thinks it's a scam and I'm on board with them. I believe I got scammed. You know, they're just a few bucks, uh, but what Daniel, um, what Daniel will uh, describe to you guys what to make is way better and a, a way better bang for your buck. So I'll play his video, a short clip of his video right now. I guarantee you, most new gardeners have fallen for this scam. I believe it's just pure scam, junk. Come see what I'm talking about. Well, what's up guys this is Daniel from Arms Family Homestead and in today's video I want to show you guys something that is a mistake that probably 90% of all new gardeners have made and that is they got out in the garden and they planted some tomatoes and everyone says you need to stake your tomatoes cage your tomatoes some way your tomatoes need something to support them because they're a vine so they went to a garden store and they bought what was sold to them as a tomato cage. You see this little thing right here? Well, this is the biggest scam I believe that the gardening industry has ever come up with. All right, guys, you've seen Daniel talking about the tomato cage scam. Do you guys think it's a scam? Leave me a comment down below. Um, I agree with Daniel now after these tomatoes just freaking took off. Uh, go check out his video right there. I'll put a little link. You guys check the rest of the video out. Um, he explains everything to you guys, how to, how to make these cages that he has and all that. Um, but I'm with him. I think it's a scam. I'll show you guys these tomato plants. Like I said, these are the biggest I've ever grown. They are doing awesome right now. You can see I got, I need a weed bad. You can see I got tomatoes everywhere. They're everywhere. It's awesome. Best tomato plants ever. I've ever grown. You see, I got some right there. There's some more over there. There's the cage, if you guys are wondering. It's just in there. I mean, it's crazy. This just doesn't, it doesn't hold the, the, the tomatoes in. Tomato plants. Look. Going everywhere. Look at this. It's branching out over into my corn bed. But yeah, you can see all the tomatoes I got. All right, guys, don't fall for the scam like I did. Take Daniel's advice. Go get you some better cages, make your own, all that stuff. I'm gonna definitely do that next season, and uh, I'll be I'll be sharing that with you guys next year, I guess. But this year, this is gonna have to do. Um, it's a little bit too late to be doing anything. I can't put no more cages around, and and these are just these plants are just crazy big now. Okay, guys, so I hope you liked this quick video. If you did, don't forget, smash that like button for me if you would. If you're not subscribed, click that little button right there and hit the little bell for notification. That way you guys get my new content when I post it. I really do appreciate you guys, all you guys watching, and uh, stay tuned for the next video. See you later.